Hello everybody, my name is Frédéric Caudron and today we will make a very nice video with my friend here, John Pro, very very famous YouTuber, Virat YouTuber and uh, I'm very happy to be here with him. We will make a very interesting things today and I hope you will enjoy. Thank you. 자, 구독자분들의 질문을 모아 모아서 푸드롱 선수에게 대신 물어봐 드리는 그런 시간을 가지고 있죠. 오늘의 주제는 미끄러운 상태의 테이블. 시합장에 가셔도 선수분들이 충분히 느끼는 테이블이고 시청자분들도 어느 날 당구장에 가면은 테이블이 미끄러워져 있을 때가 있죠. 그 미끄러운 테이블에서 푸드롱 선수는 과연 어떻게 대처를 하는지 초이스가 달라지진 않는지 두께 당점이 달라지는지 그거를 한번 제가 자세하게 자세하게 여쭤보도록 하겠습니다. So I want I will explain a little bit what happens this example. 네. No, this table is not very slippery, but we make just example. If you have slippery table and you play this one, just one, two, three, yeah. and you play high in the ball, yeah. the ball is making a big curve. Mm. And coming here, yeah. when it's very slippery. No, I can make the same here. Look, I, I make a little bit too much just to show. You see? Mm. Big curve and yeah. big miss. Yeah. Slippery table, even worse. I play. Center ball or little bit lower. Little, little bit, bit lower. 어, 중단보다 조금 낮게. English and I bang. Bang. 아, bang. <웃음> yes. <웃음> okay, one more. <웃음> bang. <웃음> I understand. So straight line, no curve. Second possibility. Yeah. But here possible, but slippery table also very difficult. Mm. I can play very slow. Ah, very slow? Normal, oh. a little bit above center and slow. Because speed makes spin. Ah, yeah, yeah. I, I, I may not have spin. Mm. Slow, straight lines. No. You see, no, no curve. Mm. This is on a slippery table, very difficult. Mm. Because even slow, sometimes curve. You see, no, no curve. So, this is slippery table, very dangerous. Ah, there. Yeah. Same problem. Yeah. A lot of ball, one curve. curve. Uh. Two cushions. Okay, okay. Look, I, I show you, I make too much for showing uh, mm. like this. 약간 오버해서 지금 보여주시겠다고 합니다. 어, 이렇게. 오버해서 지금 보여주시겠다고 합니다. 어, 이렇게. 네, 네. This is slippery table. If you play a lot of ball and even relatively slow, mm. there is a curve. Slippery table, you need thin ball. When the ball is close to the cushion, thin ball. Thin ball, English and slow. More English? Yes. Or oh, a little bit more ball, it's okay. More English. Okay. Mm. But slow. 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 So, and same. Thin is not possible because thin one, two, mm. three. I need a lot of ball, more ball. Yeah. But I cannot play high. High means curve. Mm. Curve, very difficult yeah. to control. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So this I, sh I play just like this. Same, a little bit bang, tick. Ah. Hit the ball. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like this. Mm. Straight ah, line, straight line. Yes, I understand. I think that table is the same way. I think that the table is the same way. I think that the table is the same way. I think that the table is the same way. I think that the table is the same way. I think that the table is the same way. I think that the table is the same way. I think that the table is the same way. I think that the table is the same way. I think that the table is the same way. 
얇은 두께를 사용할 수 있으면 얇은 두께를 사용하고 얇은 두께를 사용하지 못할 때는 두께를 조금 더 쓰면서 빵을 치라고 하십니다. 네. I have to say also that a slippery table is always very difficult. More difficult than a short table because correction is more easy on a short table than a long table. 좀, 좀 말씀 들어보니까 좀 저희만 어려워하는 게 아닙니다. 네, 저희만 저희만 어렵게 느끼는 게 아니고 쿠드롱 선수도 어, 시합장 테이블이나 이렇게 좀 미끄러운 테이블에서 어려움을 느낀다고 합니다. 왜냐면은 조금 더 예민하게 조정을 해야 되고 당첨하고 스트로크 신경을 써야 되기 때문에 어렵다고 하십니다. 이게 좀 위로가 되네요. 네. Anyway, the most important when you play on the slippery table is the feeling. Because you have nothing that you can really rely on. You are never sure where the ball is going. So you have to feel every shot differently. Every situation is different. And as I said, for me and I think for most of the players, it is the most easy way to adapt on a short table than on a long table and slippery table. Today's topic is the technique of the Kudurong player to improve the speed of the Kudurong player. Let's talk about the technique of the Kudurong player.